Okay, more or less the first test with APM2. There's not really, there's a wee bit of a swirling breeze about, it's higher up. So, just waiting for a GPS lock with the 3DR GPS. And now we have a lock. Armed and dangerous. Stable mode. Altitude hold. Let's try it over there. Right, the old lighter test. GPS lighter there. Hmm. Not bad. Let's come back to where I originally stuck it on. It's wandering quite a bit. I mean, just default settings. Let's take it out of GPS lock there, that's altitude hold. Altitude hold. <laughs> altitude hold is doing better than GPS lock. GPS lock there. Lighter. We're in a wee bit because that sun will be catching it. There is a swirly bit of a breeze, but I mean, as I say, that's default setting, so it's, I would say that's pretty good. Yeah, you can see the wind blow in there. You can see it in the copter. Just need to pull that lighter in a bit. But for default settings in the breeze, I would say that's pretty good. Let's take it out of. Let's try to take it out of GPS lock. It settles down. The wind up the top. Take it out GPS lock there. That's GPS hold. That's just altitude hold. Nothing else. Right, back in the GPS lock there.
so it's a wee bit tuning yet but for default the only thing I've adjusted there is the throttle P I think if memory serves me right for the altitude is sitting about 250 260 That'll do. Back into altitude hold. Not touched it, just drops a wee bit when you click it out. Let's take it back a bit. Just in stable mode. And what I've done, as you can probably tell, I've got it in simple mode just to try it out. And it's working great. As you can tell, I don't know what way that's facing. And it'll always be front, always be back. Brilliant, absolutely fantastic. Fantastic. Right, try a low altitude hold. Without sonar, obviously. Whoa. Remember when we click it into altitude hold, we're not in simple mode. Right, let's take it back. And that concludes the test for the day, guys. Thanks for watching.